Is it safe to put seashells in a nano aquarium? Hmm, let's find out. Hey guys, welcome to another video by Artistic Reefs. Um, the question is, can you add seashells to your saltwater aquarium? The answer is absolutely yes. As long as you take some precautions and clean them well before putting into your aquarium. Um, I got these shells in January. My wife took a uh, couple week a couple week trip to Colombia, and one of my requests was, if you ever go to the beach, go ahead and get some shells for me. So she sh brought these shells back for me. I'm just getting around to putting maybe a couple of these into my nano aquarium. Um, as you can see, they come in all different shapes and sizes, little color variations, uh, but the patterns are pretty cool and they can add a little extra appeal to your aquarium by just adding these. Um, one thing I do suggest um, before you adding any shells to your aquarium is do a calcium uh, check first and your parameters. Um, and get a baseline on that and then once you put in a couple uh, maybe three to four weeks later do another calcium check and see what your levels are because uh, shells are calcium based and you, what you don't want to do is raise your calcium too much based on putting how many shells you would be putting in your aquarium as you can see they're all different sizes uh, little different patterns which is kind of cool um, but I want to be putting a couple of the smaller ones in my nano aquarium uh, just to keep the uniform scale of the, uh, the aquarium correct um, if you have a larger tank like a hundred or a 200 gallon aquarium some of these bigger ones would fit great into your uh, aquarium um, but like I said I want to be putting the small ones in in there um, but as far as a precaution is, um, after you do your calcium, uh, check, <clears throat> you want to clean them very well. Um, so there are several ways you want to, uh, clean them. Uh, you want to do a freshwater dip for about 24, 48 hours, or you can actually add a, a couple drops of, uh, frag, uh, dip for corals and that should cl clean off any parasites that you're shells may have on them um, and then once you do dip them make sure you rinse them off with uh, RO water really well hope you guys enjoyed this video please hit that like button and subscribe button so you can keep up to date on our latest videos until next time guys have a good one